Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder X here back with more Let's Play Final Fantasy IX, and we're here at the uh, Estogaza store, and there's really not much to buy here. There's a bunch of weapons that we don't really need, but uh, I'm going to get them anyway. So, Flame Saber, Heavy Lance, uh, Scissor Fang, Magic Racket we have. We do not have an Asura's Rod, we do not have a Hamlin. Uh, we have a Cypher Spot, we do not have an Octagon Rod. We have a Silver Fork, we've got several Rising Suns. And that's really all we need. We have Diamond Gloves, we have Shield, we've got a couple of Black Hoods I could buy. A couple of Red Hoods. And that's really it. Uh, I am going to max out on High Potions, though. That is something we're going to need, and... Get a couple of tents. Alright, so give me a second. I'm going to work my way back down to where we were, and I will see you guys in just a second. Alright, so I've got everything equipped and changed up everyone's abilities, so really not anything super major, but uh, we're going to go this way. Uh, we haven't gone this way yet. Uh, the left path, it's basically just a couple of treasures and then another dead end. So we're going to get all these treasures before going down the well. And there's a Moogle here. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to have a letter for him, but I I just don't. I, I just I just don't. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and use a tent. Because uh, we're going to have a fight up here. And I just like to be, you know, in, in decent shape for it. Uh, what do you have Mog Shop wise? Um... Uh, really nothing that I need, so that's that's fine, and Mognet, Mogtaka, I'm pretty sure I was supposed to have mail for him. I'm not doing well with the, the, the Moogle side quests, so. Alright, so we've got this room, we step forward, and it's another one of these things. Uh, supposedly they're called uh, Red Dragons. Is that what they're called? Yeah, Red Dragons. So, these guys have like 2,000 HP. They're just kind of here, mostly. Um, especially this one, because it's just one. So, yeah. This is almost a joke. Like, I've I've got more than enough power behind this to, to stop it, and... Took a fair bit of damage from everyone. Three... Only a what? All right, fine. Let's, let's do drain. Cause he's gonna do that again. And that's just that's dick. And it killed Vivi. The hell! Oh my god. Yeah, I don't know why my my group is taking such ridiculous damage. Like, oh yeah, you're dead in two hits. I don't, I don't know what's going on. I don't understand why that's a thing. I've got really good armor equipped on people. I, I just, I don't, I don't get it. All right. Speaking of, let's get that and let's bring Vivi back to life. And we will use a bunch of potions because I need to keep people alive. Yeah, I just, I burned through a ton of potions doing that. Oh well. It's just money. I can get more. I'll go ahead and stock back up on potions. I wish I had chemist on someone too, but I don't have chemist on anyone on this team. So, really, uh, Amaranth is my, my healer. Alright. That was a lot of... A lot of potions. Alright, let's just continue on. We're gonna go down... Back to the well. Which is just right over here. I can make it without getting into any fights, I'm sure. Alright, so... What we're supposed to do is pull down on the lever three times. Supposedly there's a sign around here that says it. I don't remember 
where it is. I just remember because there's a guide next to me telling me to do these things. Uh, and I listen to the guide because sometimes this RPGs like this, especially this one, not quite as intuitive as it should be. Alright, um... Oh, there, I was about to say, there's supposed to be a trigger, and that was it, because we've got another fight with these guys, and this is going to be two of them. So I'm just going to focus on killing one with extreme amount of prejudice, and uh, go from there. Alright, Steiner, Dark Side, one of them. Vivi, you are going to flare one of them. And 2,000 points of 2,000 points of damage. Someone's dead. At this, I know someone's just going to be dead by the end of this attack. No, because it does random freaking damage. This is. Uh, well, Steiner's almost dead now because of that. So, Flare that should take him out. And that, yeah, that took that one out. Let's kill him. He's going to kill Steiner, because he's going to get some sort of AoE off. Yep, Aerial Slash, so Steiner is dead. They, there's just, oh no, there's, again, look at the random damage. I don't understand this. I've got to have something equipped on all of these people that's just causing this ridiculous shift in damage that I just do not understand. It's like, the abilities themselves could just be, you know, borked, but this seems ridiculous to me. Like, that is an insane amount of damage I just took. Let's just... Let's burn through all of our regular potions. Because those are really worth nothing. And... I can get more of those should I need them. Alright, so we're out of regular potions. That's fine. And... That should be enough. Alright. So now we can leave here, and we get to go all the way down, and down some more, and down even more. And hey, look! Kuja and the Black Mages are there. Alright, so... They're trying to extract Edelons from Eco. I'm not happy about that. Edelon of Eternal Life and Infant... No, no, let's go kill them. Can we, can we end them? I really don't want them to stay alive. If they're taking all of our Edelons that we've already learned on Eco, I'm gonna be pissed. Like, if I have to relearn everything on her, it's like... Well, and there's Dagger. And she's... still... silent. Leave this to us, because you are useless, because you can't cast spells, because you can't speak. Alright, so, working our way down, town, I, can't, I just can't not say that. <laughs> Alright. Let's, uh, that was odd. Oh, I guess they can't extract her Edelons. Okay, you're, uh, you're wasting time. Because you're both just back and forth. <laughs> Will you just shut up? And, again, with the not shutting up. I don't hear excuses. Give me the Edelons. It's like, I don't... At the age of six... Okay, so it's because... She's too young. I need an Edelon more powerful than Alexander. With the power to bury Garland. Okay, well, good luck at finding that. Bef 
before Terra's plan is activated. Okay. I don't know what Edelon she's got that's more powerful than Alexander. We don't... Oh! Could it be... the Moogle? Where did the Moogle come from? Um, hey, there's a Moogle. Just kind of hanging out. Then kill it. <laughs> Let's... Yeah, that's... I figured that's what Kuja was going to say. Kill it! Alright, are we down here yet? Can we... Uh... What is... What's Moogle doing? Mog. Don't worry, I will always be... What is... What's Mog doing? He's... He's a... He's a charge in his laser. I don't... I don't like when there's there's something about this that super moogle. All right, so I don't know what's going on, but the the moogle is glowing, and and moogles being fairies, that's usually not a good sign. All right, so we get to fight Zorn and Thorn. Use Terra Homing. Okay. I like how she's got a stick. The hell is going on? This is freaky. Oh. What are you? You're badass. Oh, I I like that. That's that's overly flashy, but that's fantastic. And Zorn and Thorn are like, well, oh, shit, we just got beaten by a child. I wanted to be by your side, Aiko, so I became Maul. I'll always watch over you, Kupo. So. That was Mog's real form as an Edelon? And she just completely wiped the floor with those guys. Yeah, I'm fine. I just summon a giant, you know, winged lion man beast. I never knew that Mog was an Edelon. Disguised as a Moogle. Even though she was weak. Yeah, that makes makes it really entertaining when she ran away from us. I guess Mog could tell that Garnet was a summoner as well, so that we were good people. And Mog's ribbon. Oh, that's actually kinda sad. Mog will always watch over you. That's true, so. Oh, hey, it's Kuja. That Moogle went into a trance. An eruption of anger against one's surroundings. Okay. Not the will to live, nor the desire to protect another. I simply need a powerful soul. Okay, that doesn't sound good. And it can be found there. Would you just stop with your nonsense? Yeah, you can be done with us. We're done with you. Oh! Vivi! I hear these twins, but... Okay. They're not really twins at all. Yeah, what about the black mages? Uh, Vivi. Vivi, where are you going? Uh, what the hell is happening to Zorn and Thorn? That's... That's... Freaky. Okay. So, we've lost Vivi... ...in the party. Because he ran off, so I guess we get Echo in his place? Jesus Christ, that's... That's just not 
Right. Alright, let's, um... Uh, I don't really know what to do with this. Let's just wait for that. Because uh, we've got some things to steal. He's got three items, so we're just going to focus on stealing those three. Golden hairpin uh, is one of them. The vaccine and a demon's vest. So, let's... Viral smoke. That... Looks like it's gonna be bad. Now you're all carrying a virus. Oh, and Steiner's in trance. How wonderful. Um. Oh, virus. Crap. Um. That's probably gonna kill Eco. Because virus makes us zombies. Or no. Where is it? I know I have a vaccine. There we go. Um, so that... Uh, hopefully that won't kill Echo. Alright, so that's... Yeah. Let's steal and we'll have Echo continue healing. And... That's something that happened. Speaking of vaccine, stole one. I really don't want to waste, uh... Uh, Steiner. And, and you're in trance, too. Alright, let's... Um... And, okay, so there's nothing on her. So that's fine. Alright, so stole demon. Okay, so we stole everything, so let's just beat the crap out of them. We're done. Kira, that's gonna suck for everyone involved. Let's just rip you a new one. I'm so done with your bullshit. <laughs> I want nothing to do with your crap. I've got two people who are, at this point, gods. And... I'm just gonna keep throwing out Kira. And done. Done. My two tranced warriors just... Oh, they don't get anything because of the virus. That's... That's... That's what that does. Okay, well, doesn't matter. That's it's 11 AP. I AP is kind of pointless to me. Yeah, where's Kuja? Everyone knew he was lying, but they still followed him. He said our lifespans can't be extended. Yeah, do you really Yeah, where are the others? They're all sitting down over there. What am I supposed to just tell them that, you know, everything has a limited life. Nothing is immortal. All I can do is just sit with them. Poor Vivi. And Zidane is just getting more and more pissed off. Woman? Who's... Who's here? Who would be stuck down here? Where has that Kuja gone? Oh, I know who this is! This is, uh, this is Sid's wife! Hilda! Could this be... Yes, this has gotta be Hilda! Not that Garnet can say anything, because, you know... So whatever brought you to this dreadful place? Um... Kuja! And the hates Frog Lops in! And I bet she's ec just ecstatic to see him. Yep. Do not remember ever marrying a toad. 
that mustache. It really is you. Uh, yeah, we know. We got it back. Well, did we? No, we didn't get it back. So, uh, you know Kuja? Yes, let's find out about him. Alright, so we're gonna head back to Lindblom and, uh, figure out what's going on. So, uh, but I'm actually going to end this episode here. Because there's a lot of stuff going on. So, uh, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next installment where we figure out what's going on here in Lindblom. So, uh, till then, later everyone.